hi everyone welcome back to my channel my name is Andrea and you have come to gratefully blessed in my mess and this video is just kind of a chit chat video I haven't been on in a while um, I just been just been kind of taking a break um, just enjoying um, this peaceful journey I guess right now um, hold on I'm gonna crack open my Alani um, Alani this is uh, breeze berry we're gonna try this one I've never had this one before but yeah so um, I've just been taking a break from YouTube um, just kind of I've been working out every day um, and just enjoying uh, just enjoying my surroundings I mean just spending time with my husband when he gets back and um, trying to get our printer to work <laughs> we he bought me a printer um, so then I can sell my bags as I'm here and it just, I don't know why the Wi-Fi is not connecting. It's like Bluetooth and we're having a hard time with that. So, um, hold on. Hmm, that's super good. This again is called the Breeze Berry. I've been getting these. Um, every week and having one a day they're probably not good for me but um they taste really good this one tastes really good too i haven't had a bad one yet um but we've uh oh you guys uh this past saturday my husband and i went to downtown omaha and we went we visited the stores um the the atmosphere down there was amazing. The stores were phenomenal. And the restaurants and bars and um, it, we went into a brewery and, um, and had a drink there. It was just, the atmosphere was very, very low key. Um, just wonderful. We parked and we just walked the whole thing and um, I didn't I wanted to film it but I wanted to take it all in first so um, we're gonna go back and then uh, I want to take you guys to all the cute little shops they've got like these this old candy store it's just a little tiny shop uh, sell that sells like the old time candies um, they have ice cream parlor they um, have an all leather shop which my husband was shocked because we went in there and they had these um, hide on hair uh, bags leather bags and I mean they're like two three hundred dollars and um, that was like I think on sale and my husband's like do you want a bag mm, no he's like I'll buy you a bag do you want a bag no, he goes, I cannot believe you're turning down a bag. Well, I didn't want to buy a bag just to buy a bag. I didn't really like it. I didn't, it didn't have, for me to buy bags anymore, I have to, unless it's like a dirt cheap deal, <laughs> you know, um, I would get it. But um, if, if it's just, a bag that I really for a couple hundred dollars I have to love it um, and I didn't love it and he's like now that's the first you've never turned down a bag yeah I have <laughs> I have turned down several bags that he's wanted to buy for me and excuse me I just didn't didn't like it I didn't want to spend his money when it wasn't something that I really liked but um so maybe when we go back with you, 
Maybe I'll like another bag there. I don't know. Maybe we'll find a different, there's so many stores there. It's just so kind of overwhelming. It's really overwhelming actually. But they have um, the, um, like they have stores and um, restaurants and bars that are like underground. So you walk down the stairs and you can go into a store that way. There's um, a whole like a walk through type thing that you can walk underground through the other, through the other um, block. It's just really cool. Um, like if you don't know, if you haven't been to my channel for very long, I am from a very small town. Um, we don't have any of the big stores. We don't have Veer Bradley. We, we don't have any of the big stores. So uh, we have to drive like two hours to get to a Veer Bradley. And so I was like stoked when I went to my first Veer Bradley store. It was, that was so much fun. And so when I see stores in like buildings, like tall buildings and stuff, it's like, I'm like so giddy and like, oh my gosh, did you see that? Did you see that? I'm like constantly, I, my husband says that I'm like a little kid because he, he knows how I am. He knows I have to soak everything up and just take it in and <laughs> it, it's just so much fun. And when we were, we were driving back from Michigan, coming back here and he, it, that's, that was over a 10 hour drive for us to, and it was on a great day, so we made great time, so it was a little over 10 hours. And we didn't have the radio on. We, it was just him and I talking the whole time. And it was like, we're like kind of finding each other again, I guess you, you would say. Um, Cause you know, we've been so busy is parents and um, a wife and a husband and you know working and not really taking time for each other I guess we did but we didn't you know it was all geared right to um, our kids our home our family and now it's just him and I and it's been so much fun it's it's like it's like we're dating and going out on dates and I mean we did we did that every Friday when you know when we were together anyway when he was home from work or whatever but this is different this is like um, I don't know it's 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 been really really nice and um, and then the other day, I, I told him that, uh, I said, you know, I feel like I need to go home. I feel like I need to go home for a little while. And he's like, but I don't want you to go home. <laughs> I, want, I want you to stay with me. And um, I don't know, I just felt like I needed to go home to make sure everything was okay. I mean, my son is doing great. He's got all the pets there. Shelby, our little dog, did not come here with us. She's back home. Um, she missed, her and Samson missed each other terribly. But, um, and here, is, I mean, being here is, would not be good for her. Um, she's, you know how little dogs are barkers? She's a barker. And uh, we would probably be kicked out of this hotel faster than, you know, because she does like to yap. Um, so it's a uh, it's good that she's back home where she was she's happy she loves it there um, and so I just felt like I needed to be home just to make sure everything was good um, my son is he's into he goes to school um, once a week he's in an electrician uh, pr apprentice program so he works during the day and then uh, one night a week he is in class until nine o'clock at night. So um, 
I just want to make sure he's doing good and uh, my daughter she's doing great she graduates from college in April so um, then you know she gets her she's got her big girl job all lined up it's all ready and waiting for her she's super excited um, and she's going to be heading to Boston in July her college actually um, asked her to to be uh, a speaker for one of their programs um, so they chose her to go to Boston Ex all expenses paid for flight hotel food all of that so that is a really really um, I mean my my kids are seriously uh, amazing my daughter just rocks it I mean she's doing great so but the mom and me you know still wants to make sure that you know my kids are okay I mean I'm only a phone call away and a FaceTime away <laughs> but I mean you know I still I still need my hugs from my kids too so that has been a little bit hard for me um, you know I've been away since the end of November and <clears throat> hold on here try not to get all teared up <clears throat> so <laughs> I've been gone since the end of November and it's yeah I just kind of I just kind of miss them a little bit you know um, but it's they're doing fine I just need to you know be be strong because they're adults they're um, they're you know making a life for themselves and um, yeah but you know I just I just love them <laughs> they're you know they're my kids I love them so but other than that, um, we're, I'm loving it. I, I really, really like it here, you guys. Um, I really like it here a lot. Um, like I said in another video, we're, we're booked in this hotel until April 15th as of right now. And um, I'm, they can extend it because this job is going to be go for longer um, but there's so much work here in this area that we could be here for 10 years and um, and yeah and the only thing that I don't like about this area is it's super windy it is really windy here um, but it's, I like all of the um, the conveniences that are around. <clears throat> um, I feel like I say um a lot. I'm <laughs> yeah, but I I just wanted to pop in here with you guys and touch base with you. Um, I have seen some videos I want to put up. But I have to go to Michigan <laughs> to get them. I ordered um, three America's Thrift Supply Boxes. Two were purse boxes. One was a five purse box. The second was a two purse box. And the third is a shoe box. So um, I want to get them and uh, do videos on those, the unboxing. I have, I don't know if you guys can see, I did, I thought I had, um, I got some envelopes here um, to ship bags and stuff out, got some boxes, but I thought I had my Poshmark store on vacation mode, and I didn't realize that when I was home, I took it off of vacation mode, and I had sold a bag when I was here and then I got notification that uh, you're you need to ship your bag like 
come on lady get that crap a moving and I was like whoa I didn't even know what <laughs> so my printer's not working so I had to go down to the um, down to the office in the hotel here and um, use their printer which I mean it's for the public I mean, well for the guests here so I can use their printer anytime I want their printer and computer um, so I need to get my uh, whatnot show started I am haven't you know set that up yet I'm kind of nervous <laughs> I don't know what the heck I'm doing but you know um, and that will be live but I have my my purse is here and um, I'm ready to get rid of them they're taking up a lot of counter space here I mean from here all the way down there is just purses so I need to get rid of them because I do want to go to the um, thrift store that is I think it's a couple towns over I took you guys there once before um, and I want to go back to check the purses out um, to check out if they have anything new so and if I could do that like once a week you know just kind of browse through and take you guys thrifting with me that I know my husband really doesn't care for thrifting he but he does it because he knows I enjoy it so he goes and wanders and looks through stuff but <laughs> so he's super patient um, and uh, had I drove myself I would you know go there but I did not drive myself um, yeah so maybe next time I don't know I really don't like driving that this far even though I would be following him but you know sometimes I just kind of panic when I get around those truckers because those truckers are rude they're rude but anyway um, I guess this is like an almost 20 minute video and um, I'm just a little bit chatty <laughs> so I plan on taking you guys to downtown Omaha with me here very very soon I'm not sure if we're gonna go again this Saturday but um, if we do, you guys are coming along with me because you guys have got to check it out. Okay, you guys, I will see you in my next video. Um, I'm going to try to at least get one a week up. Um, I'd like to shoot for two, but hey, if I can get one, I'm doing good. So you guys take care and I will see you in my next video. See ya.